Well, hey everybody, 650 Eve here. Welcome home to the channel. As you can see, I pulled out my 2016 Kawasaki Ninja H2. You know, the beautiful 352 horsepower machine. Just lots and lots of parts on this bike. Excellent tuning done to this machine and it is faster than it has ever, ever been. But you guys wanna hear a cold start, so I will give you that right now. just a couple weeks ago on my beautiful built motor 1600 cc carpenter racing engine Hayabusa that was an easy kill it's going to be even easier to destroy him on this Ninja H2 but you guys want to see it so I'm going to provide it for you But just the other day I went out, my beautiful Z06 did some driving with some of my good buddies and we had such a good time, man. I can't figure out which is more enjoyable. The spirited driving we did in the Z06 and the other supercars or riding the H2, you had a cold start of the H2 Z06 time. <laughs> We agree. It sounds great, but now it's time for me to mount the H2, do some testing, and see how this thing performs with all of its new mods. Let's give it a test. Second gear, 60 mile an hour hit. All right. That felt great. <laughs> that was nice and fast, yes. Yes, that was nice. That was a nice hit. I'm gonna pull over into the middle lane and let the bike cool down. I got my boost temperatures at 131. So I can't do repeated back-to-back -back hits on this supercharged machine because the boost temperatures get too hot the oil gets too hot and it gets very thin and then that causes excess uh, 
excess clutch slippage and whatnot, and we don't want to do that, but I do want to give it some more tests because that second gear roll felt great. And I also want to test to see if I can actually do a first gear roll at 60 mile an hour. That seems to be the great, the great agreed upon speed for me and Artis Fast. 60 mile an hour works good for both of us. Well, at least it did for my Busa. I destroyed them all day, taking off at 60 mile an hour. <laughs> so I think we want to try to continue to do that. <laughs> Our good buddy Art has absolutely nothing, nothing on that brutal, savagery, controlled acceleration. That was full throttle, second gear, 60 mile an hour, and there was no wheelie. That is amazing. So the acceleration is similar to my Bosa as far as control, but it's just much, much, much more brutal because this bike makes more horsepower and it's supercharged. I want to try a first gear hit. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> oh, that, first, <laughs> that first gear hit was insane! Absolutely mental. This is one of the spots that Art and I stopped and chatted about. The victories I put on them when I was on my 1600cc Stroker Carpenter Racing Hayabusa. But now, I'm on the H2 doing some tests and this thing is just performing savagery. Art should be very happy that I did not have this machine in my possession when we raced the first time a couple weeks ago because he would have been destroyed even worse than I did him the first time. But I am preparing to actually bring this machine out to spank Art because he's gotten a little bit beside himself, him and his followers, thinking that they can destroy me in his 2,000 horsepower Datsun GTR. He is going to be in for the surprise of a lifetime when I pull this machine out and destroy him. It's performing great. I've got some more tests to do. And then I'm going to show you guys what we, the amount of fun we had in the supercars on the filthy streets. That first gear launch was just savage. I want to test it again. Decided, guys, it's first gear launches whenever I race this bike. <laughs> it's controllable, it's savagery, and man, oh man, oh man, is it absolutely brutal the acceleration. There's no way that a supercar can defeat this machine when it takes off in first gear. It's much, much, much more aggressive than second gear hits. First gear. 50 mile an hour. That is absolutely ridiculous. Ridiculous, guys. Hi, Art. You think you're fast? Let me show you, buddy. This is fast. <laughs> That's a first gear hit that the GTR just can't come back from. It just can't. It's not possible. <laughs> I love it. That's what it's all about, guys. Getting out with your machine, testing, making sure that everything is all set and you're prepared for a race. Art claims that he wasn't prepared when I raced him. You know, you guys might, it might look like that I jumped in all those races, but I did not. The flagger put his hand down on the third swipe, and I took off. Art just was mesmerized. I mean, it was the sound of my motorcycle that did it. 
it was just the sight of a full carbon Medusa taking off before his blue eyeballs that did it. And also his bike, his car is twin turbocharged, so there's a bit of lag involved. All of that is not my problem. My problem is controlling my machine and putting the smackdown on people. And I did just that against my son, Artist Fast. I'm behind a Hyper 1 ZLE or whatever the... this Camaro and its exhaust makes mine sound like pure filth and it's also spitting a lot of exhaust and liquids all over my windshield but this thing does sound absolutely mentally insane I wish my Z06 was as loud look at this damn thing I wish it was as loud as that thing is complete and as you saw the busa is a sick savage now that it has the 43 tooth rear sprocket new clutch fresh oil it is ready to slay artist fast even worse than my beautiful full carbon busa did last time guys it's going to be vicious so keep watching go to his page and send him some messages help him come out of hiding and face me like a man because i want to destroy his beautiful 2000 horsepower Nissan GTR again. This one will be the third time, guys. Okay, <laughs> keep watching, guys. Me and Artist Fast, we're going to get it on for your viewing pleasure. Stay tuned. Thanks for viewing.